Have you ever had a dream that that you um you had you 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 could you do you you want you you could do so you you do you could you you want you want him to do you so much you could do anything? Hello, it's me, Boo, and your favorite angry Pikachu. Oh, I tried so hard to rhyme that, and it still it still didn't sound good. <laughs> I hope you all are doing very well. I just wanted to say thank you so much to every single person who subbed to this channel. You have made this channel come as far as it is, and I think this is gonna be my last video uh, before we hit 50K. So thank you very much. Love you long time. You're my favorite. So today I kind of took a poll on Instagram to kind of ask like, yo, is there anything you guys want me to talk about in my videos or like touch base on uh, regarding the Pokemon community? And let me tell you what, it's depressing out there. <laughs> it is so sad, so much sadness in the responses. You know, I don't know what I really expected, but I guess people just asking my opinion on the dumpster fire that is the Pokemon community, or should I say stonks, uh, of Pokemon right now. And I decided I probably can't just like lightly touch on it when we're trying to hunt for a golden monkey today. So I'm probably gonna do another video um, just talking about that. And so you guys can just stare at my face while I jibber jabber about Pokemon topics. So I guess we'll try that out. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably gonna be super lame, so. See you there, squares. But no depression in today's video, because guess what? We've gone through ETVs, booster boxes, blister packs, pre-release kits, a vivid voltage, and we have not pulled our only gold card I've ever wanted in my entire life. The golden monkey. <laughs> so. For the last act, I guess you could say, since we're about to jump into Shining Fates and into Battle Styles, we have singles, baby. Single packs of Vivid Voltage, 30 of them. So, oh, 27 of them, <laughs> just kidding. That taco happened to find at GameStop. I have no idea how, but we purchased them with this single grubbin. And then, uh, yeah, now we have them to open for the channel. So I'm gonna be opening 30 Vivid Voltage packs, trying to get that golden monkey. Manifest your truth into the golden monkey. <laughs> so yeah, let's get into opening these 30 packs and probably be disappointed again. No, no depression. Let's do this. Alrighty, hey, 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 why didn't I open these beforehand? Oh my gosh, I just realized that, oh, it's actually not that bad. I was like, man, this can take forever. I gotta open all the cardboards, but I guess we'll we'll rock with it, see how it goes, but anyway, I don't know why I'm struggling to open this pack right now so hard. <laughs> all right, let's see, let's see. First pack, I feel like it's gonna be something good, okay? So let's just, put our hearts toward positivity, all right? <laughs> um, I'm, I'm just scared right now. Reverse Hello Dreadnought and... Yes! See? You wish it and you will receive it. Galarian Darmanitan, VMAX, Mr. Popo, the love of my life. I absolutely love this Pokemon. I love this card, which is funny because I despise Regular Darmanitan, it's disgusting. A thing can just be wiped from the Pokédex, honestly, for all I care. <laughs> but I love this one! Galarian Darmanitan is my jam. He's so cute, and we just got him. So we are cruising today. If you guys are having a tough day, I just wanna say something you can look forward to is that I will be doing some giveaways for Shining Fates. Once the set drops, once we're rocking and rolling with Shiny Fates and actually opening product, um, I just felt really terrible that a lot of people weren't able to pre-order the product. And I definitely want to, uh, I don't know, I want to give back to you all. I'm really, really excited for Shining Fates and I want everyone to share that hype. So hopefully it goes to someone who really deserves it. Fampy, <gasps> amazing rare Zamazenta, absolutely gorgeous. And Electros non-hollow. So even though we didn't get a pull, uh, from the last card in the pack, we still technically got a pull. This is actually the least popular one. Not not in like popularity, but I rarely pull 
this goober right here. So he is very, very gorgeous. Zamazenta, so beautiful. So the thing about buying singles, I rarely do it because you're never really guaranteed anything. Like at least in a booster box, you kind of know the average amount of pulls that you can get. So usually booster boxes are the best bang for your buck. But when you're buying singles, you know, I could open 30 green packs right here or 30 white packs. You have no idea. So it's kind of a toss up, but you know, I've tried absolutely everything and I hadn't gotten the gold monkey. So I figured let's give it a try. Let's see how this goes. And so far it's okay. It's okay. Not hollow grap locked, lifting those weights, getting nice and swole. Tell you what, it always feels so, so good when you actually pull like above average out of singles than you would for like a booster box. So we have a little under booster box, only 30 packs instead of the usual 36 from a booster. So let's see what we can get here. So far, no bueno, but I don't know. I feel like in singles sometimes I'll just like randomly pull a secret rare and I'll be a little happy chicken nugget. And so that's what I'm aiming for. Um, speaking of chicken nuggets, how about that McDonald's Happy Meal toy promo Pokemon hype diddly do da day? <laughs> if you guys didn't know, McDonald's is doing Pokemon uh, promo packs, probably for celebrating the 25th anniversary of Pokemon. So it's kind of applicable right now. So I'm really excited to get my hands on some and see what what's in it and unbox it for you all. I'm so excited for it. Memory Capsule and Lucario non hollow. So, uh oh, SpaghettiOs. We did get that reverse Memory Capsule, but <sighs> it's not looking good so far. That's like, what, three non hollows in a row now? Ooh, scary. Ooh, this is also something you have to worry about as well is just like these packs getting absolutely torn up in the packaging. So be careful when you buy singles that they're not like damaged. Oh my gosh, what is up? What is happening, dude? This like gooed. It gooed all over my nails, man. Oh my God. <laughs> Please be something good because you just wrecked my nail there. Goo pack. Ooh, fist bump energy. Maybe that's hype. Maybe that's hype. Matang, Matangalang, uh, Milk Ball, Meowth. I'm gonna miss Milk Ball so much once we switch sets. Swallow and... <gasps> oh, snap! The glue? The glue is good luck? What? Wow. I've rarely pulled any secret rares from this set. So to get a secret rare item, the centering is not great, but still very pretty. Um, I actually don't play this in any of my decks, so unfortunately I can't use it for bling fodder in my deck, but uh, still great to have in the collection. Always need those secret rares to finish out a set. So very happy about this. All right, I literally just went and scrubbed my nails. <laughs> that glue is like on there, dude. I mean, it was worth it to pull the secret rare, but dang, this packaging is wackadiddly do. Tell you what. Okay, so we already have a secret rare. <sighs> I feel like that's good. That's good sign, I think. That's a good sign for the rest of the packs because that means they're in there. They're in there somewhere. I just gotta actually pull them. Reverse hollow mudbray and a shift tree non-holographic. So within all of these green codes, there will be a golden monkey. I hope everyone who's playing in the Players' Cup, Players' Cup 3 has been having great games, some good luck on there. Uh, I did a stream playing a couple of key tournament matches, and it was so much fun. Uh, let me know if you guys want more streams like that, TCG streams where I just chill and play with you all, because it was so, so much fun. We played for like, what, four hours? It was wild. Tynemo, Reverse Hollow Terrakion. Ooh, that's a rare. Heck yeah, Kool-Aid Man, baby. And <gasps> Electros, non hollow Another one. Celery the Celebi. Gotta be good luck. I usually actually get really good pulls out of the Celebi packs for some reason, so hopefully that is the case here today. We shall see. Ooh, another Fist Bomb Energy. Yo, you know I have good luck with those. Usually, sometimes, a hey, Slugma Country Road. Beldum, Milk Ball, Matang Reverse Hollow, and... <gasps> Okay, it was a white pack. White pack indeed. I actually rarely 
ever pull these. This is like probably one of four, I think, that I own. It's insane. Hopefully we get some more because I actually need quite a few of him in my uh, baby Charizard deck. Oh no, the glue. Back at it again with the glue. Okay, I'm gonna be careful this time. Oh, this is so bad because like, you don't wanna bend the cards in the actual pack. I wonder if I can like open this from the other side. Okay, I think it's upside down, probably. So, let's see if we did this right. Hey, that's what's up. Loudred, Winden Stadium. I can beat some uh, some glue. Me versus the glue. <laughs> Ninkata, or Ninkata. Reverse Hollow Fampy, dude, I pull so many of these. And a Zapdos Holographic as well. Okay, I ended up just unsleeving them all because I went to count them and then they're all stacked on top of each other and then it was a big mess and long story short, this is why I edited my videos. Uh, <laughs> so I also counted them. We have 20 packs left. So that's out of 10 packs. We got the VMAX and a secret rare. What is happening? Did my camera just explode? <laughs> Man, this video can just not go right today. And we're back. All right. Woo, what a whirlwind of a video. Obviously, like Pokemon doesn't want me to make this video today. I don't know why. They, they want me to have all the obstacles in the way before I finally meet my beautiful golden monkey. <laughs> Reverse hollow heroes metal and a bonnet, non-holographic. So green code pack for us. If you guys are ever confused as to why I say green or white uh, packs, it's actually the code card within the pack. If the back is green, uh, it's going to be non-hollow, and if it's white or above, it's a hollow or above. So an ultra rare, secret rare, you don't know, but it's going to be good, pretty much. So green is no bueno, and ooh, look at that Rayquaza! Oh, snap, and a grab locked on the back. Amazing rares, though, I don't think it shows a white pack. Like, it could be a green pack, and you could still have an amazing rare. Uh, they don't do the white packs for amazing rares, so I guess you could still technically get an amazing rare, like this beautiful Rayquaza from a green code pack. I'm very happy we just pulled this little green bean. Speaking of code cards, might as well unwrap this pack and thank Poetown, my sponsor on this channel. Look at this cute little ad that they made for me to advertise their code cards. If you guys play online or want to start collecting online, they have tons of code cards and code Pokeboo will give you 5% off. So that is hype. Beldum, Fambi, Duskull, Electric, Sableye Reverse Hollow, not a rare, but kind of looks like he would be. And Exploud, non hollow. Oof. So this is not looking too good here. Things are going kind of downhill. We still have the Amazing Rares, which is kind of rescuing this opening right now. But, oof, not even one Ultra Rare. Surpri well, I, I guess we have Darmanitan. But um, not even like a regular V, I guess. Eyeball Energy. We have the V Max, which honestly I would rather have the V Max. But still, I'm kind of surprised we haven't pulled a V. Tynemo. Vaporeon Reverse Hollow Rare. And <gasps> Diancy. So a holographic, a white coat. This is also another reason I hate buying singles because I just feel like the packaging is always wackadiddly do. Oh, and it's upside down. Black Mamba, Nessa, <laughs> Crocodile Boy, Pharaoh Seed, Riolu, Sandile, Cute Little Whalmer, Weedle, Telescopic Sight, Reverse Hollow, heck yeah. And. Vaporeon, the regular one. So we got the reverse holo. Now we have the non holo. I feel like I most commonly pull the reverse holo water Pokemon, which I'm actually a huge fan of. I like the normal type and the water. I think those are the prettiest reverse hollows. Man, I'm just wrecking these cards today. Milk Ball, <laughs> Skidoo, reverse holo heroes metal. Yo, another one? Another one. And Terrakion, Kool Aid Man. <sighs> Maybe all of these medals are leading into, uh, or congratulating me, maybe, on uh, my future golden monkey pull out of the rest of these packs. Please, please, Pokemon, please, Beldum, Fampy. Oh my goodness. Well, I guess now we know you get a lot of amazing rares when you buy singles <laughs> and an executor. So it's kind of going the same way. We get the amazing rare and then end it with a non-hollow beautiful card, this little Celebi. 
gorgeous little guy. Absolutely love the Celebi. Wow, so we haven't even doubled up on Amazing Rares. We have one of each, excluding the Jirachi so far. Gotta love the Amazing Rares. I cannot wait to see where they go with all the Amazing Rares. I'm so, so excited. I love Amazing Rares, like the whole concept, the design. They're super cool. So I would love to see them continue to make them and make them really spicy looking. Another reverse holo telescopic sight and another Terrakian. Yo, what is this? What is this Pokemon? A replica pack? No. <laughs> I mean, I do like the telescopic sights. I like having the blinged out reverse holo version of them. <sighs> but this was, you know, $4 a pack, so. <laughs> Uh, I mean, I guess, I guess it could be worse. I could be getting scalped like $15 a pack by everyone else that's struggling with that right now. Don't do it, you guys. Don't buy packs, especially singles for that much. Not worth, not worth. Kakuna and another Banette. I don't know. We're kind of dwindling down here. I'm getting nervous. I'm getting nervous about this. Uh, Yanma, Wooper, Dedene. Ooh, Reverse Holucario, rare, and... Ah, oh, the hollow Snorlax. Hey, at least we pulled a beautiful hollow Snorlax. This is a gorgeous card. I always love pulling Snorlax, especially the cute little hollow version of him. I don't even know if he actually comes in a non-hollow. Is he only hollow? And jumping into our next pack here. Kind of scared. Kind of scared to see what happens. Matang Rang Pie, Mumu Cheese, Puchiena, Charmander. I feel good about this pack. I feel like we're going to... Wreck, wreck it with, oh, never mind. Ugh, I don't know. Ah! Oh, no! I think we need to bring in Angry Pikachu uh, for good luck here. Maybe he'll scare these Pokemon packs because you don't pull good for me, Pokemon packs. Angry Pikachu's gonna be angry. He's gonna rage. <laughs> A Black Mamba energy, Moose Cheese. I mean, hey, even if I pull Absolute Garbaggio, it's still nice to open things for you all on the channel. It's fun for me. Hopefully, it's fun for you all to watch. So, Reverse Hall C Dot and another one. Another one. I don't need non holo executors, please. Pokemon. I know maybe you thought, oh, she's kind of lacking on these. Let's, let's give her a couple of these, but please, please, no. Charmeleon Skidoo. Eevee, I really like that artwork of Eevee and of Trubbish actually as well. Choodle, Fampy. Another one. Oh my God, so many replicas here today. And a hey, or Beetle V Max. You know what? I'm happy to see it. We haven't been pulling much heat, and even though this is not a deck I play, it is still a pretty solid deck that people have been playing. Um, it does counter Colossal, so anytime I actually go up against this with Cole, I'm just like, well, peace out, guys. Uh, it's not my day today to win at Pokemon <laughs> because grass decks absolutely destroy Colossal, so that's a bummer. And I don't know, I, I just love that Orbeetle is kind of a Pokemon that people are just like, Oh, it's Orbeetle, you know? But it's cool to see, um, I don't know, a Pokemon kind of shine a light on some low-key Pokemon that nobody really cares about. Uh, <laughs> Here we go. A couple of packs left. Water Ball Energy. Zebstrika, Excadrill. Cute little Charmander. Whooper taking a bath. Meowth, Cottony, Under the Sea. He really is. He looks like he's on... Oh, ah, see? I thought he was like in water for some reason, which actually would make no sense because he's cotton ball, but he's actually in like a fairy garden or something. So there you go. The more you know. Aracuda, reverse hollow trainer again. So this probably means it's gonna be bad. Toucan Sam. Okie dokie Artichokies, six packs left. We only have a couple of like super spicy cards. I mean, at least, ooh, fist bump energy. At least we got some amazing rares. That's really cool, especially if I was trying to like finish out my collection. I do have many um, amazing rares already, so I didn't really need extras, but for someone opening these packs that needed the amazing rares, would have been sick. Um, Trying to remain positive. Hey, Ampharos V, just as I said that. I guess I shouldn't start talking negatively before we open the rest of these packs, because honestly, like I said, it could be the rest of these packs are all white codes, you know? It could be three secret rares in there. We don't know, okay? Nobody knows. 
Do I really hope it's a golden monkey? Yes. Will I cry myself to sleep tonight if it's not? Also, yes. <laughs> but let's see how it goes. <laughs> um, oh god, I'm scared. Fireball, electric. Uh, I kind of want to see another turkey boy. Hey, if there's a turkey boy in this pack, it'll be good luck. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, turkey boy, kind of. I mean, he's not a bird, but semi-turkey boy. <laughs> and oh my gosh, ninjask, non-holographic. So a swoobat and a ninjask. Angry Pikachu on standby. Come on, baby, another fireball energy. Do me well, please. Mudbray, Poochiena, Charmander, little cheeky nugget, reverse holo is there, or a yo, I never see this one. That's a reverse holo rare. And this shift tree haunts me in my dreams. His chin's his body, I don't understand. <laughs> I'm so salty right now, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm salty. Oh my gosh. All right, three packs. Three packs left. I'm not sweating profusely right now. No. <laughs> I didn't cut coconut bangs just so you guys couldn't see the sweat that happens during my Pokemon openings. Uh, <laughs> definitely not. Turkey boy! Here we go. Let's see what happens here. Come on. We got the luck of the turkey boy. Dude, two turkey boys. Here we go. Here we go. Rock rough. Oh, reverse hollow. Now I'm scared. Oh, okay, okay. It was not um, anything super crazy, but just the fact that it's an ultra rare, honestly, I'm hyped about. Colossal V, this little cute cucumber boy. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling this one. Dusclops, Rocky Helmet, Whooper, Meowth, Cotton Ball, Aracuda, Ninkata, Reverse Hollow Trumbeak, A. Eh? That is not a Reverse Hollow Rare. Okay, never mind. And. Oh! <laughs> so. One pack left in our journey. And it's a uh, Celery the Celebi. Not feeling the best about this, not gonna lie, you know. Manifest your truth. Maybe. We will see the golden monkey in this last pack. <sighs> Go Goat, Mudbray, Country Road Slugma, Absolute Cutie, Whimsor, Execute, Woobat, <sighs> Moment of Truth, Reverse Hollow Excadrill, and. Oh! No, I'm just kidding, I don't rig my packs. <laughs> no! All right, my goobs, I've literally tried everything under the sun to get this golden monkey and it just hasn't worked out for me. So I think it's just time to uh, accept my fate and maybe just purchase the golden monkey. Just buy him. <laughs> it's not the same as pulling him. I am still always going to want the golden monkey and hopefully pull him out of a pack one day when I continue opening Vivid Voltage, but there's so much content coming up on the channel that is not Vivid Voltage. It's going to be Shining Fates. It's going to be Battle Styles. So we're kind of segueing away into the new new. So hopefully you guys enjoy everything on the channel coming up. I can't wait to celebrate 50k with you all. Wow! Halfway to 100! What? I can count! <laughs> <laughs> I will catch you guys in the next video. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Bye-bye!